Ooh, the game so is first, starting. Our first map is Busan. I do love a good Busan map. I'm hoping to see... Well, l last time I cast it, I saw, I saw the, the D.Va doing some questionable things, in our, like low life. Right. Uh, trying to 1v5 the second the game started. And it was, it was definitely a, not, not the most ideal play, I'd say. Right. I was, the D.Va... Well, D.Va really is good. Really trying to go for the full dive comp thing. And honestly, that is a great Ooh. strategy. We got on uh, US Tell, so. we have Low Life on Diva, Starkey on the Sombra. Happy to see Ethan on the Sojourn. And his Sojourn is. Yeah, that, that Sojourn is kind of broken. Riot on. Ooh, I did not know that uh, Katsuna was allowed in comp now. Oh, uh, yes. He's been disabled. Or so, enabled, I mean. Uh. Yeah, you're talking about mm -hmm. Kiriko? Yeah, Kiriko. Why did I say Kitsune? Yeah, that's her alt. Yeah, uh, uh, Kir Yeah, you said Kitsune, and my brain just completely laughs. No, Kiriko was allowed Tuesday, was the exact day mm. that she was allowed. So now you get to see those little kunai just flying through. So here comes an mm -hmm. early contest onto control point. This is definitely a route I don't see a lot of teams taking from there. Yeah. I usually see them going either straight for the point or fighting in the middle. Starkey is rocking the Sombra. She's gonna go to the back lines. She's gonna Ooh, get the she, Junkrat. She's gonna really get the. And Junk is about to get dove. Junkrat really is dead. dead. Ooh, they have lost the Junkrat. That's definitely a lot of damage gone that, that for you as that, that is a tank killer gone. Here comes Reaper. Reaper's contesting. Yeah. Right now, I think all we see. Moira is, is focusing on the Sombra, but Sombra gets away with the teleport. With literally one HP. Oh, there goes. Ooh. There goes zero. There goes a Diva. Well, life's out. Baby, Baby Diva gets immediately melted by Reaper. That's gonna be. This is, yeah, this is going to be their point early on. Yep. They don't have the health pack on backside though right now. Just so USM does lose. USM the point. needs to regroup. They right do now. cap the, like a fifteen percent, but they do lose the point, and they're going to lose a little more percentage. So going to just start putting some hate down onto site. Mhm. Mm Cesaria Junkrat, I believe, is just waiting up there for someone to just try to peek him. I mean, right now, he's all to the closest to being up. I, it's, I believe it's going to be Moira's alt, but I think it's going to be up the, the fastest. There's the Junkrat. Oh my god. I think I think Ethan started shooting at the Junkrat mid-air, just melting it. Right now, just Ooh. up top. Ethan that's about so, to have all up. Sojourn. Zero. Here comes the ultimate. Mm -hmm. Reaper. Reaper's scared. Ooh. Kiriko. Oh, he's feeling get a hit. Mm-hmm. He's looking for He's looking for the opportunity. Oh. oh, he almost gets the Reaper. At this point, to not see any headshots or kills with that ult. I oh, do there believe it is. There's the headshot. Mm. Uh, the he Reaper's does take dead. out the Reaper. We do get the Zarya alt out along with the Moira alt. There's one DPS down, and Kiriko, but right now we're down a tank and a healer, so I think we need to yeah. leave. Both Kiriko alt and Sombra are, are, are almost up, along with uh, Nano Boost being up as well. There's Kiriko, Nano, and Sombra all, all at the same time. Ooh, too far for the SMG to do too much damage. Ooh, the big Sombra alt. That, taking out the Zarya, all, that's going to be huge for allowing you with them to recap the point. There taking out the Reaper, Reaper as well. And now Diva Bomb. I hear them calling out for the Kiriko mm -hmm. hit. Kiriko's Kiriko. dead. Moira's dipping Moira. out. She's going to try to she's gonna try DPS Moira this. But USM does take back the point here. Here, it, here is point back, but they have 15 to 78 right now. Mm -hmm. We do have, however, Nano and uh, Zarya alt up. On the enemy team, they do have Reaper ult about to come up, along with Kitsune just being used second it comes up. Are we going to see a... This is probably, this probably a good chance for the Diva Bomb to go off if she throws it up in the air. Where I do believe she's just waiting for all of them. Or yeah, that. There we go. She's going to wait for the... Her, I don't think it's going gonna to get anybody. First. It's not, but it's still going to push them off site. Mm -hmm. A lot of pressure. Ooh, the Reaper dude is taking out them. That Zarya mm -hmm. laser, fully, I think almost fully charged, maybe 80%. That's what it looked like. And just absolutely melting. Anything. Anything in its sight. They do also have Moira all almost up again, which is definitely going to be scary to yeah, deal this with. This is going to be scary for USM to retake. Here comes Junkrat. Junkrat is hacked. I don't think oh. the Junkrat's not going to be picked up. Sombra there goes Starkey. Starkey sadly gets eliminated. Picked off by, the, by, the, by old Symmetra, I like to call her. There's Grav. Diva on the point, but the, the sh tank Diva's shredding of Reaper. And here goes, there goes Reaper. They're touching point and continuously Over time right now. Is Sombra going to get die? there in time? Is Sombra going to touch while invisible? No. Oh, not quite. a second earlier. 
That was a pretty close first round. Mm -hmm. uh, 51, they got the point at first. Lost it for a decent amount of time. Yes. They needed to be able to push onto site better. Definitely. But whenever they were popping off, they got a team. They got a nice team wipe, and they kind of staggered the Moira at the end, inadvertently. Definitely. I think they were just trying to kill her in general, but they they happened to stagger mm -hmm. her respawn, so they got the point for a little bit longer. But 51 to 100 in that first. Oh, the, never what? mind. I remember. I okay. I remember why Ethan told me to go May and put a wall on that now. That, that was... I used to play, when I played with Ethan, he told me to go maybe put a wall on that. I asked why, he wouldn't tell me. And that was... That, now I know why. Cool. I, I, I didn't mind that, that was funny. That was pretty silly. Shout out mom, my mom keeps trying to call me. Bad times. <laughs> Shout out Phobia's mom. <laughs> Here we go. They popped, Ooh, they popped so the much damage on in that. Reaper, so now Zarya is basically full charge. Zarya is a bit, like she's pushing up a little bit further than her team, but I think she can still get healed from there. Mm -hmm. They're gonna start losing the high ground and getting down onto point. Here comes Ooh. low life, just eating all the Reaper shots, which is probably Zarya, the best Zarya thing laser right is going to be able to go through the fence matrix. Yeah, it yeah, and it's almost fully charged, and it's mm -hmm. not very nice for USM at the moment. Zarya already Here at fifty percent all charge. Zarya hacked right now. She is low I mean. low-ish health, but immediately getting healed by Mora. She's hacked again, so she's going to be taking extra damage from USM right mm -hmm. now. Here comes Zero on to trying to hit the... That was the Junkrat, I believe. Yeah. My brain had completely lapsed for a second. <laughs> I feel that. We switch on to a Zarya here to counterpick mm -hmm. on the other Zarya. Well, I mean, Zarya is definitely just... Here comes Zarya pushing to the Moira, the Reaper in Zarya's face, and just immediately melting the Zarya that's mm -hmm. alone. I think that was a little bit of a early push by USM. I don't think that's quite when that should have happened. I think Lola should have taken another second. Taking away for the rest wait, of the wait team. Wait for the rest of the team. Starkey, low health, waiting for the Moira just to spray, spray some healing powder. In Zero the getting picked up by the junk rat bomb. Ooh, but Starkey going behind. Starkey's gonna. Starkey's gonna. Go, Is he gonna go for the back cap? Back cap. Ooh, I love to see some back caps. Back cap. They are. I do. They are off point. But here comes the Moira just immediately fading back onto site. If he can get away. He yeah. does get away. I didn't notice he had the teleport down, but he has the teleport in a very good position. Not one, a good position as in healing, but good position as in escape. Yeah. Reaper. Ooh, they do get the Reaper all out, but it does kill both of the supports. We need to back up here. I think. <laughs> oh, is Stark here to go for another back cap? He's going to go for the bit. He's going to go for the health pack that's back here. Mm. He's just gonna he's gonna juice this health pack and get back and try to back cap. And that Moira is just waiting on him all the time. Yeah, that didn't have his thing down or his teleport. Ooh, pack Zero down. picking up on the junk rat. One. That's one kill for Zero. Let's see if he gets the Reaper here. Ooh, just barely misses. The Reaper fades away. Mm-hmm. Let's see if they can get the Big Zarya Lucio here with, with the Lucio ult. There, I hear the calls for everyone to look at Reaper. Reaper's they get dead. the Reaper. That's definitely a lot of damage. Here's, here's Kiriko. Kiriko. Oh, Ethan They're, just picking up kill after kill with his railgun. They're calling for the Kiriko, but Ethan's still looking at the Zarya. Mm -hmm. More low, but I do believe she does get away. And someone got booped off the map. There goes. Someone got booped. I believe the Junkrat got booped off the map. Or he just fell. Or he just. Reaper, Reaper can't fade. Reaper needs to get killed. There's Reaper dead. They have a hard fight right here. They're calling for Blossom. They're calling they're for. Be, they're to be cautious, but as we can see, he doesn't. Yeah, have they're also Blossom. calling for Tyre at 40%. Yeah, then. A little bit, but they don't get they don't get to see the ults like we do. I know. So they're, they're only playing. They're playing the mental game. One thing. Zar Zarya is dead. Yeah, Ooh, Zarya they do. Here. They do yeah. pick up the Zarya. One thing that I do. Kiriko uh, ult though. Kiriko ult's gonna push Tennessee back onto site. It's basically gonna be a someone fight does need to the contest. Touch. Here comes our Moira to touch. There Ooh, goes. The death sadly, blossom. our Sojourn's now dead, and that's gonna be overtime. Mm -hmm. Over, and it's gonna be for Tennessee. They take map one. East Tennessee. Who's gonna that was play, that was a dominant showing from East Tennessee. Definitely. We do get oh, oh zero, <laughs> zero hacking. Uh, I mean Starkey hacking to play from a zero. That I believe yeah. that highlight intro is bugged right now and just reversed. But 
It's that, still. That was funny. I like that. He's stealing it from his own teammate. There's one. Oh, we got one. We, we need to see it. We need to see it. Sad. Mm. So right now they're getting a little bit of coaching from Sam, our resident juice box hero. The juice box hero. The juice box hero. Mr. Overwatch, also called in the lab sometimes. Mr. Overwatch. Mr. Overwatch. Uh, I believe that next game with a little bit of mind or mental game adjustment, yeah. this could turn out very well for USM. Mm -hmm. The second game was definitely a lot closer than the first match. Yeah, it felt a lot more competitive. The first match just felt like a lockout, yeah. like a complete lockout of sight. Uh, I will say on their team, Venti, he hurt. Just he did hurt. He 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 hurt, <laughs> or they hurt. Sorry, let's. I'm get hoping to see what the next map is. Though. Uh, next map is not Busan, but mm -hmm. I, was, I guess it hasn't switched yet. I thought it would have. So, what are you expecting to see change from USM? I'm hoping to see like, because I remember uh, last time I cast it, I'm talking about how they want to have like a lot more accurate alt call callouts. Yeah. Hoping to see a, like a bit of better alt tracking, maybe some more communication. That is why there is no uh, mm -hmm. kill cams yeah. for the players in this, is so they can't alt track. So they're only guessing based on time. Yeah. They hadn't seen a tire in a while, but also the jump rat seemed to be getting picked off quite and fast. And also jumped off the map. And also jumped off the map. Uh, so he seemed to be getting picked off quite fast, so he didn't gain his ult charge, so it's Hollywood next. Yeah. Hollywood's Ooh. an interesting map. Definitely. Uh, Hollywood, one CP, then payload. Mm hmm Hybrid. Hybrid. I miss the two CPs, man. I miss two CPs. I don't. You don't? I, I miss the map, but not the gamer. I, I miss Hanamura. I, I really okay, Hanamura, Hanamura I do miss. Not Egypt. Those games could last, like, a minute. Yeah. Because they were so... Cause attackers. I, I miss Hanamura, and that's on two CP. But not, not Egypt. That's no, fair. Not, not Egypt. There was another one, wasn't there not? I don't think there was. I think it was just Hanamura and Egypt. I think they're they're missing out on not having Hunter Murray. You, you can still play them in custom, but not oh, yeah. in uh, not in quick, quick player. They do have they do have two CP coded in, so maybe next season mm -hmm. we get Hunter Murray back and not Egypt. <laughs> One thing I am hoping for, I want Push to be out of the competitive uh, competitive playlist. Yeah, Push is a little a little. Empty. I mean, it's ten minutes long. I mean, it's at least ten minutes long, and it's only one match. Right. Whoever, whoever wins first just wins the game versus the other ones. I think it's a cool idea. I do think it's a cool idea. No, it's a good idea, but not good for competitive. Yeah, because it's just one. Yes. And that overtime can last seven ever. I had a uh, Total Mayhem push game where we were playing against Zarya. Oh, Lord. Me and my friends chose not to go Zarya because we're decent people. We w hey, the we, don't, game we, don't, we don't talk about Zarya like that here. In Total Mayhem, we do. Oh, okay, in Total Mayhem, yeah. Zero cooldown on her shield. Oh, so she can just yeah. constantly. Mm -hmm. And you can't kill her. We did find out that uh, Winston alt can knock her back. That well, that's game good. lasted 35 minutes. That's one we thing. won the mental game because they left. <laughs> I will say that it gets very interesting. You can't knock, you can't knock uh, Zarya with Orisa's mm -hmm. uh, spear. Yeah. Uh, you can't knock her with either the spear throw or the javelin spin. Yeah. Sorry, I am, spear, I'm hoping to see a Zarya nerf soon, just so we don't just have to see Zarya. They're and actually planning on putting her bubble to 11 seconds, mm -hmm. which is, it might not sound like a lot, but that one second, that one second, it really can. Yeah, especially since she has, uh, uh, I don't, I don't remember what it's called. It's not shield. It's not HP. It's the blue, the blue HP. Uh, it might be called shields. Oh no, yeah, it is called shields, and the uh, orange one is called armor. Yeah. So she gets shield on top of it, and shield regenerates. Yes. Because that's what Zenyatta has. Zenyatta has shield as his natural health, and he gets in it auto generates. Yeah. I am. I am glad to see that we. She doesn't have armor though, because armor yeah. does take reduced damage. And that's what makes me. That's what makes playing Orisa fun for me. She is unkillable. It's the fact I, Peta, the worst. <laughs> I, I have flanked as a risk before because I saw it on TikTok and I was just like, you know what, I'm going to do it. And my friends were like, please don't. And I was like, I'm doing it anyways. I, I do like her new ult a lot. Yes. I have pulled up some uh, pretty decent plays with mm -hmm. uh, Soldier ulted and he was up in a window. I jumped up, pulled my ult at the same time and I pulled him down to the level, into ground level. And then he was not very happy. He, I can imagine it. I mean, how, I mean, how Ooh, would you feel I, if you I, love, I love this map, Pariso. 
for you, so. I yeah. love it. I love I It's just the, the colors, the scenery. It is, it is in Brazil. The map is, uh, does take place in Brazil. Yeah. Now, this map. This is, this is a difficult map to play, especially if you're playing a map, or playing a match like I was last night, which had a massive skill difference, and I was like mm -hmm. the lowest one in the lobby. Uh, you can definitely get spawn trapped. Yeah. This map is easy to spawn trap. Yeah, this map is definitely very heavily, heavily defended. Two, two, two of favorite. the new maps are extremely easy to spawn trap, and it makes me very sad. Because mm -hmm. this one uh, is a hybrid, and the other one's just a payload. And the payload one, it makes me really sad. I forget what the name of it is off the top of my head. I do just, but I do love just the design of the map, though. Right. It is beautiful. The col uh, I know they took inspiration off of modern day uh, Brazil, and the colors on buildings, you just don't see that type of stuff in uh, North American building yeah. design. I, uh, I do visit a lot of family in Mexico a lot. You see a lot of those buildings, you know, like in mountains and stuff, and right. it's just really, really colorful. Default skins only. Sad. I mean, especially down the fact that it's been $20 on a skin, and right. you can't even wear it. You gotta go, you gotta, ro you gotta rock Overwatch 2 D.Va. You can't even rock Overwatch 1 D.Va. I do like Overwatch 2 D.Va's mech better I, than I 1. I like, I do like Hanzo better. Oh! oh Hanzo source. picking up. There is a Widow back there. I hit yeah. a uh, Widow quadra kill play in the game on this map yesterday. Really? Mm -hmm. I like how he, t he types, well. <laughs> There's a Love to see that the other team isn't salty about it, just making jokes and having a good time. I mean, you can't really be salty about it. You you it, walk out, you get an arrow to the face. What else are you gonna say? You can. I probably just laugh. I would just be sad. I'd just be sad, honestly. Mm -hmm. That's that's probably what he would. Well, one thing that I do it. love on this map, I play a lot of hide and seek with a bunch of friends on Overwatch. Right. This is one of our favorite maps right now. I will say, as as we're holding this bridge right now. Uh, the diva right here is really oh my god it's not easy but really vital in holding this bridge because first she can defense matrix and basically cover the entire team as well as she can dive that roadhog at any point whether he be right behind the team or right in front of the team she can just the dive potential of diva scares me as a player mm -hmm. and they're going to try to back cap but Zero's not going to work get back. especially on this map because from the uh, point where you just spawn cat and you can just turn around and stop the back cap. Right. It's so close to the, the spawn, it's... So you can spawn hold and you can stop back caps almost instantly and it's mm -hmm. pretty Ooh, interesting. So here we go. There's gonna be a he, big he's gonna EMP. He's jump in and he's gonna EMP, he's detected, he might as well do it. Mm -hmm. Here we go. And now Zarya's up top. Zarya's dead. They're calling Moira. Moira's almost dead. Oh, we do lose Easton with the Genji dash, but Moira is about half HP. Sarki does have to Moira teleport away. Fight. That so health tech is hacked, but it's about to end, so. Genji's so low, but I, he does make it away with some Moira heals, too. They have they have a uh, D.Va bomb right here. Mm -hmm. Sarki gets the kill on the other Sombra. They do have a minute and 40 left to, to hold the point before they cap it. Crawl up the wall, little Spider-Man. Mm -hmm. Here comes the Kirika ult for USM. Genji Blade is picking up the kill on the Sombra, but I think that's all they're going to get from it. Here we go. I mean, Hanzo Zarya just... Zarya's low, Zarya's low. Hanzo just having these arrows. Genji gets hit by Genji's, one. Genji just killed by the uh, Kiriko. And all I do like how he had, he had his arrow already primed, yeah. where it let him keep his uh, multi-shot. I mean, Hanzo, his arrows just, just finding their target. Only with Zero's help. Zero's masterful aim. Oh, okay. Uh, as I say that, I think yeah. I jinxed him in some shape or form. I can't believe you do that to him, John. Sorry, Caster Curse. He just... <laughs> I think they are going to have to cap the first. They are going to have to be able to cap the first point. Yeah. Here comes Genji. Did Genji use... Yeah, Genji used his blade in there. Yes. Here comes Kiriko. Sombra trying to get the Kiriko. Not going to be able to... Immune. Mm. Well, sorry, cleanse. Yeah. And then Diva's gonna uh, die. Are they gonna get the? I don't think no, they're gonna be able to get the Genji. Oh. They do pick up the Moira. That Moria, or Moria, Moira, Lord. No. I think you did cast these in there because you missed the shot on the standing still Zarya. Right. Uh, you know. 
Yeah. It happens to all of us. We, we can only we can only compliment so much without caster cursing, apparently. Mm -hmm. Baby Diva trying trying to play her life. I don't here I think is gonna be able to not gonna make it out of it. They Baby are, Diva. They are chasing. Baby Diva heavily. putting out so much damage. Picked up the tracer from zero. The baby, baby diva is still alive, and she does get the mech back. They're, they're targeting Zarya, pushing her back. Ooh, Genji down. She is so charged up right now. Definitely. They're backing up. I mean, the they're basically the, going to concede this point. The, he has bomb. He does have bomb. I believe he's waiting for the point to come up with the other players on the team coming up. Look right here. Right here. Oh, hacked! Up. I think he was going to use it there too. He's gonna wait till he's low health and then probably jump out with yeah. him. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if that's gonna pick up. It doesn't pick up anybody. No, they all hid from it. Here's the tracer. Mm hmm. Run, running around, being a nuisance. Like tracer is. Tracer's the queen of nuisance. <laughs> so. I actually would give it to Sombra. Oh, well, yeah. They're, they're both pretty. They're both pretty slightly annoying. Like mildly mm -hmm. infuriating. Maybe want to close the game. Oh, they get they get low life out of mech very quickly. I do believe they are going to take the second point as well. Or the first point, no second. Sorry. Yeah, they first first push of the payload. Yeah. Two minutes and forty seconds left to cap the last point. Two minutes. That's we are going to see Ethan switch to switch to McCree though. And the and low life, yeah, Cassidy. Mm -hmm. We love the name change, man. I'm I'm so used to it. Can we? Oh, she's gonna she's gonna grab it on, on I, grab. She's gonna grab both Sombra and the and Arzaria. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we're picking up, trying to pick up the Kiriko here. She's gonna, she Not teleports, gonna, and Zarya is just going to be able to get. Zarya, yeah, no. Zarya's gonna get killed there. Mm -hmm. This is also one of my favorite parts of the map, like cause the like dull, also like neon colors everywhere. Right. So our Sombra is going to probably go, oh, she finds the Double other. Double Sombra. Oh, but the other Sombra does get the hack off, but is going to teleport away. Yeah. That was that was a good find for our, for our Sombra. Mm-hmm. There goes their Sombra's ult. She's going to teleport four. away. At one life. HP. Got five seconds. Oh, low life bear is going to make it up. But saved by the Kiriko Purify. Uh -huh. That's going to be the Genji down. Zarya's very low. Zarya, Zarya, Zarya is at pretty much 100% charge. Ours, yeah, Zarya's... And Zero's going to... I didn't even notice he got two headshots. He got the Zarya and the Kiriko. I mean, Zero is oh, the Kiriko. hitscan guy. Yeah, uh, hitscan Andy. Mm -hmm. He's shooting around. He doesn't like the fact the Sombra could be lurking around. One thing I will say, I do not like the crazy new pistol that much. It, it looks clunky. Looks clunky. Oh. Hi, Noon. Oh, oh look, he, he got deflected. Whoa. He did. <laughs> I can see the frustration on Zero's. Missing all of those shots yeah. because they've been bobbing back and forth. They do have 50 seconds left. They have 50 seconds left. Almost, they almost have blade. They almost have they grab. Have more, they have Tsune rush. They almost have a grab. They almost have grab. But they do have grab. the. They do the have. EMP uh, is far off though. They, they, our EMP. Mm. So Moira is down. Ethan does go down. We're gonna try to focus down the supports. And the tank. Tanks or tanks. Tanks secondary. Big, when it big comes Genji. To down the big supports. Genji blade. Ethan gonna have to switch to the widow. Hope. Hoping okay. to see a nice pick here. They still have grab. They still have Kasune. Right, there's a couple hits. That Ooh. bubble. That was a that was a reach for the. Bubble. That was a clutch bubble. They used grab only on Arzaria. Might not have been the best play here. Genji's Genji down. dead. It is overtime, so I didn't do no get them off the No healing allowed for the right now. One more, one more fight. They, oh, but they, Tennessee does have EMP up. They, they TP out or Sombra TP out. Kasune and EMP. They have Kasune rush right now, and Zarya is just trying to hold on for her life at the moment. While all these, while she gets hit by a oh. purple. Oh. They did switch to Ana and Reaper. Oh my God. And Reaper did again. What, I believe literal one we, HP. We have one more fight. One more fight we, left. And we on. have to run in all at once. Mm -hmm. I don't think they're going to be able to because they need to contest the point.
They're continuously touching. Oh, oh they couldn't. Zarya right there. Zarya, hold it. They have zero seconds on the, on the half, mm -hmm. though. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so I'm definitely just needing the cap point with literally just right. a, a millisecond would be enough. Right. So that, that fight at the end was the deciding factor of them getting all three mm -hmm. points. And sadly, they couldn't respawn fast enough. Yeah. If they if they respawn on just a little bit quicker time, that's a soccer ball. That is a soccer ball. Ooh, are <laughs> we gonna look at ball. the guitar? I think, I think look our the spectators room. just admiring the map design. I, I would mean, do. just like you would. Oh, look, it's Lucio. Yeah. Lu yeah. It's Lucio's the cereal. <laughs> oh, Lucio's. And the frog. I think this is it's Lucio's it. little corner. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> I think this, this might be Lucio's hometown. I think. I think that we should probably start looking at the gameplay that's about to start. No, no, we're we're looking at map design real quick. Guitar. Records. This is cool. I, I love this map. This mm -hmm. map is... It's so well designed. Down to like the finite details. There's so many little details. Easter eggs in it. The tricycle down there, I believe. Ooh, I, 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 think, I think our spectator is hungry. Uh, he might be just hungry. I think, but right now, five, four, three, two, two one. one. And right to the Zarya. There we go. Spectator doing a great job at, at his job. They have a monkey. They do have the monkey. They have, they have a Winston. And Lucio does have the home field advantage here. Lucio has the home field advantage everywhere. I don't think that's home true. Field. Definitely wasn't true in Egypt. Very, very true. That was Anna and Farah. The monkey is diving on Oh, it's easy. Oh, Ethan barely makes it out. You don't climb up the wall? Little Ooh. little wall climber. They're calling for the monkey as Zarya focuses on the Lucio. Mm -hmm. Trying to get both the support and the tank out in one fail Ooh. USM does lose uh, its damage in both of its supports. I don't think they're going to be able to cap off of this, point, this fight. That was a little bit of a... A heavy, a heavy-handed push mm -hmm. by Rosaria there. I think, uh, just from the spectator point of view, I think a play for their life would have been better there. Yeah. Hindsight's twenty twenty though. We all know this. So we're gonna go for the back cap. <laughs> Not quite the back cap, oh. but just in general trying to hit the monkey with a hack. Oh, barely missing the arrow on the monkey. He's trying his hardest here. Mm -hmm. They do pick up the Kirikar. They're going to pick up the Lucio. They do pick Ethan, up the Lucio I think as well. Ethan's having a bad day. <laughs> I'm going to blame it on you. Yeah. I think it's because we haven't named this guy Ethan yet. And this, I think I'm, we're going to name him now, Ethan, for today. Let's see what happens. All right, so we now have our little our, friend Ethan on the desk with he us. He is losing his hair rapidly. He, yeah, because... One of our one of our players decided to you know try to comb his hair out. <laughs> Me. Huh? No, nothing. Yeah, yeah. One of our League of Legends players mm. might might be go by Connor Fortnite. I don't. I think you should stop. Why? <laughs> I. Oh, a big ooh, dragon! Big gotta dragon. force him out of the room. Oh, oh, getting stuck on the. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can see the regret. You can see you can see the sadness when he gets stuck on the lip of the building. I'll teleport back. Ooh. Try to get into the. Oh. Whoa. Gets into the room. That is a bad place for Tracer to be. <laughs> you cannot kill them while they're in that spawn room. Mm -hmm. That's why this is a bad part to hold because they can just see directly where Point's about to be. That oh, tracer, <laughs> that Tracer's camping. That Tracer's not. I don't think she's gonna make it if they if they see her. Tracer does get away because she's Stark, Tracer. Yeah, Stark. He's gonna try to go up to high ground. He's gonna get to see where their Ash is. Mm -hmm. Monkey's up there as well. I think I think it's loot. Yeah, there's almost Monkey all four. Monkey just eating up these arrows. He's going to eat. Primal Rage. Kir they, pick, they pick the Kiriko and the Tracer up. Monkey is so low. And I believe they're going to pick up the Monkey yeah. as well. Monkey kill there. Oh, they, I think it's going to be a team kill. Lucio. Lucio and Tracer, the only two left alive. Oh, Lucio barely gets away. They're going to try to stagger this Lucio. Like, if they can get one hit on him. Oh. Oh. Wow, never mind. That's <laughs> not gonna happen. If they could get Lucio, then that would have delayed the next team fight. That would have worked at all because the Tracer does lose the Pulse Bomb on only one. On uh, only a Hanzo. Well, the Pulse Bomb's not, it's only good for like targeting DPS, so that was the perfect thing. 
That was the perfect time to get rid of abilities because two Kitsune rushes running at the same time. Mm -hmm. And, but they also dropped the beat. So... Ethan just trying to shoot from far away. Oof. It's Ethan versus this Tracer. That's one hit. Yeah, kind of... He almost got exactly where it was. Definitely. It would have been, it would have been a nice clip. That, that would have been... an awesome hit. Definitely. They know they're back up top. Honda's up there causing, just being a nuisance, as mm -hmm. always. It's Genji and Hanzo and uh, Kiriko that can climb oh, the balls hack like ends that. at the worst time. Are they going to be able to tap the second point? They aren't contesting. They are just Ooh, Tracer is contesting now, though. Tracer's the only one contesting at the moment. Ash's dynamite's coming in. Tracer runs away. They aren't going to be able to pick up the Tracer. Ooh, I think the Zarya's going to lose Zarya just hits from behind and he can't. Mm, before she can tell the Zero, zero getting a kill. But Kiriko immediately coming and just headshotting him out. They have a minute 50 to get to the next point and also... I do, I do love the weapon charm on Kiriko. He just has a pin in her hand. Right. The riot is just... Throwing Sending darts. out two knives. Just throwing these darts. And so they're gonna Sombra's gonna back pressure. Point. Maybe get maybe get the ash up here. Let me go up here, hack the ash, and then probably just delete her. Not quite the delete I was looking for here. Oh, they're gonna be able to pick up the Zari here. I do believe that Zari is fight. dead here. I yep. Yes. They stole the health pack if you saw that. I did. Shark is gonna put. Uh, she's gonna put her teleporter back in their back lines. Zarya is gonna be pushed up next to their spawn to try to delay them as much as possible. Shark is gonna get a hit onto Ash. She's gonna wait until she can go back into the Zarya is separating. Zarya separating Zarya here. Here comes Lucio. Our, our Zarya was so charged there. Some are getting away along with the Tracer. Yeah. Ooh, he's gonna be able to pick up the kill. Ooh, just barely. They're calling. Our, the Sombra has the EMP. They have to get a touch, or else they're not gonna. Ooh, Zarya one much. shot, but she does live. They get a both of the damage. They have a D.Va now. I think this D.Va switch is going to be very... Lu picking up the kill on the influence. Lucio. They're not... There's Kiriko. Kiriko's going to teleport back over But she is Zarya. like... One, she is one shot. She's like a mortal. There goes they pick Kiriko. Up the Kiriko. Now it's just Zarya on site. Zarya's going to solo grab... I guess Kiriko... I guess our Kiriko does uh, jump Oh, back dropping in. the beat though. That beat probably saved their Zarya. Definitely. The Zarya still died though. Oh. They'll I don't think it did. Probably saved for a second. I yeah. Because they were all probably still Here targeting comes her. Our own tracer zero mm -hmm. coming in. Ooh, right they're, into Bob. But they're gonna get that. Definitely, very very close. Yeah. They're gonna get that point and secure another W for East Tennessee. <laughs> Oh, like getting, getting a play of the game. We're probably going to exit out in the middle of this, but there's a grab. Oh yeah, this is where Zero was upset with himself. <laughs> let, let, let's hope I don't cast or curse Zero next time again. <laughs> Hopefully. If Zero's cast or curse, those headshots were not hidden at the second half of that. Yep. I mean, you were complimenting him, I was like, he just man just doesn't miss, 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 And then miss, immediately miss, misses. Miss. <laughs> I'm not liking what I, what I did to this man. Yeah, I think you might have to personally apologize to him, and he will no. not understand a single thing. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna walk him and say like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry for what? Think, I'm sorry. You think you're talking about the loss, it's something much greater than that. <laughs> it's so much greater. It's the caster curse. <laughs> Sends shivers down the best player's spine. Mm -hmm. 
Still definitely a close game, Sent though. Shivers even down the best players' spines, is what I was trying to say. But I had a hiccup. So, right now they're discussing strategy, but how to deal with their tank. Their tank just continuously walks up and is getting constantly healed. It's not even that they're doing a dive. They're just battling. Yeah. And it seems that every battle is just getting lost by USM tonight. Mm -hmm. They can't seem. They don't seem to target the other supports as much as the uh, other teams. Tennessee. Yeah. Targets our supports. Mm -hmm. It seems that every fight, the first two people to die on USM side are the supports. In a fight against ETSU, uh, is that right? Yeah. In in a fight against them, the first person to die is normally a DPS and then the tank, yeah. which is a bad order. In the fact that the two supports are still alive and they can either escape, they can just make it much more difficult to kill the tank. Yeah, and they're and they're just constantly making it harder, and they keep targeting the Zarya when she's getting basically pocketed by yeah. both healers at the same time as bubbling herself. On this map, I'm hoping to see a, if if USM is on defense, hoping to see the, the Eastern Widowmaker on the first yeah. on the uh, first point. But, uh, if we get the Ethan Widowmaker, um, especially if we do Circuit Royal mm -hmm. or Circuit Royale, whichever one. I, uh, I was playing the uh, Lava Parkour on this map. The Lava I, Parkour? I rage quit after a certain point. <laughs> I don't like the parkour maps. I got to 14 and I, then I, just, I couldn't do it anymore. Could My be. mental was just crushed. I was, you I think was, we see a sub in here? Possibly? Possibly, I do I think not a, know. A Starkey for Reflex, like we did last, or the, it was the opposite way around last time. It was Reflex for Starkey. You yeah. think we see it the opposite way around today? I don't know. Because I, I will say that it was a different game whenever we switched mm -hmm. uh, Reflex out last time, mm -hmm. and I don't know what the call here is. Mm -hmm. well, I don't know what Sam's thinking, uh, because I physically, because I just don't have his brain. And also, to no discredit to him, he's trying his best right now to secure a win for USA. I am hearing their uh, their comms, and they're saying they're not going to try to focus the tank anymore. <laughs> that, that's a good start. That's uh, definitely a good start. Focusing tank is just padding your own damage. Like, this is, that's what I see in ranked. They just, just, just pad your own damage numbers, as well as yeah. never gets a pass the mitigated damage on, a, on, the, uh, on the tank. Here we go, is Circuit Royale. Most of the new maps are very pretty, although very beautiful. Yeah. This is the other one I was talking about. This is the streaming in the whole spot. Are these actual uh, I, I, I wasn't looking at that. I don't think they're easy to see. I think they're just playing easy. Uh, I think cool if they played easy for those actual teams that were playing. They just got to really have to do a robot thing. Look like we are. I think we to say hi to the little robot. I don't know how to relax and calm I do like the Both sides roll with Sigma. I guess oh, Sigma's okay. really good on this map. I guess there's a meta here that I didn't see. Accretion. Now he's gonna, he's gonna basically. I don't know what that move is called. The, the suck. The, yeah, I was about to say the suck. He's gonna hit by an accretion. Low life's gonna die there. They're gonna Making push. Tank and the support. Push extremely far out for only just getting in. Oh, the hack doesn't come out before the shield does. Yeah. And that's going to be a... The, the Helix Pixel is picking up Ethan. They are pushing extremely far up, allowing one person just to be cart bot. Man, who is the cart bot right now? I think it's the support. Yeah, it's definitely a support. I believe it's the, uh, it's the Ana. Yeah, it's probably Ana. They, they can hit... Yeah, there we go. Ooh, There's Ethan the picking up the Widow. Kills the Venom Mine as well. Oh. oh. 
keeps on almost hitting the head. Like when, whenever it switches to Ethan. Just. Unlucky. Hack on the SIG. Oh. Zenyatta. Zenyatta's being carbot right now. Zenyatta's hurt. Zenyatta's dead. Go to Zenyatta. Here comes the Are other we gonna have a Widow there. fight? Oh, oh the Helix no. rocket. The big rock. Oh, Siglo. Sig is about to... What is that melody? I, I, I love his voice lines in this game, too. Yeah. Uh, I have actually heard a conversation between Sombra and Sigma, and it's the saddest thing I've ever heard in my life. Mm -hmm. Sigma's lore is very sad. It is. Multiple personalities, multiple yeah. interdimensional brain. Yeah, one of them is, like, extremely evil. Yeah, one of them extremely evil, one of them extremely kind. Yeah. Then the kind one's supposed to be him. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, they're, they're they are, I don't know what they're doing. Like, they just, it's working for East Tennessee, but it, it's just mean. I know. They're just chasing down every USM player. We do have player. EMP, oh, almost every single alt up on USM side. This, the Sigma here is just mean. There's a Picking soldier, up a soldier. And then oh, Sigma gets Starkey. Falling onto the race track. We have, we have Vinyata being being a cart bot again. They're trying their hardest right here to try to push Sig out. Mm. There's a hit. Oh, Ethan is beautiful hit. Showing that widow who's the best one. We have, we have a Kasune rush. I believe low that was a team kill. Able, low life not able to pick up the kill. Oh. And the Helix rocket on Widow again. They just, they just keep finding Ethan. This. This has felt like a run through this entire time. Yeah. Sigma is hiding up top. With the Ana, I believe. With the Ana. Here, here's Genji. Genji got oh. him hit. Genji got him rock. The big rock. So they're on us sleeping. It's gonna go up. There. And oh, then the big Zenyatta yeah. tranquility. Ooh. Blocking the Ana from getting to tranquility. They don't have Picking up the Sigma. Their Sig gets hurt and killed. Mm-hmm. Ooh, this is this is a tough fight right here. They have to fight here for four minutes. It's not impossible. It's, it's gonna be difficult though. But they're actually, they have the advantage here because they're closer to their spawn. Definitely. I mean, yeah, they, they pushed very far ahead, very fast, but if they can hold right here, if ETSU uh, makes even the slightest mistake with how they push when it comes to mm -hmm. how they push, this might be bad for them. But they've played very masterfully so far, so it might not be good for us. There's one in the back line, or Genji is harassing the back line. Ooh. <laughs> that ragdoll of Anna was very funny, though. Attack Visor gets two. Genji gets zero. Why did Sparky get away? But the Sigma is dead. No one is pushing cart. No, there's no. Nope. Oh, there's the cart bot again. So there goes Zenyatta. There's, there's the Sigma just holding spawn. Their Sigma is very aggressive. Very. Their Genji's also very aggressive. Mm -hmm. well, that's Genji though. Yeah. That's, that's a different story. Jeez. The nano boost of Genji is the no joke. The here, the EMP is probably gonna come out. Oh. Oh no. 2.44. That's gonna be a hard score to beat. Yeah, but we might see an overtime here. We might be able to see us get all the way through. I will say, this is only the first game of the night for USM, though. We do have Rainbow Six right mm -hmm. after. Uh, I believe their game is eight. Late game? Like league last night? Yeah. I'll, I'll be running the gauntlet tonight. It's going to be... It's me and Connor right now, and it's going to be me and Aaron. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to be running the gauntlet tonight, yeah. trying to get through this. <laughs> what do you need to see from USM to, put, to see a successful push and a possibly a game four. I gotta say it again, I wanna see the Arisa. Arisa's definitely, I believe, very good on this map for taking the first point and getting out of spawn. Right. 
But we are seeing the Sigma on both teams again. We're seeing Sigma again. Is Sigma just a, a pick here? I, I don't know much about the competitive state of this map. So. Yeah, I don't really know anything on the collegiate level or a professional level, but I will say Sigma's not really uh, on my radar at most points in time. Mm -hmm. But One thing I will say, he does need to put the dogs away, though. Huh? Sigma does need to put the yeah, dogs away. Yeah, he needs away. to put some shoes on. Imagine stepping on, like, a, a needle. That's why he floats. Mm-hmm. But still, I don't want to see that. Yeah. We don't want to see that here. It's a family-friendly environment. Mm hmm we do have the Ana perched up right that there. Ana is, is the Ana the only one on it? Where is the rest? Uh, the Ana is the only one that's going to be the oh. aggressor. They're all going to be in back. And that's going to be the Reaper dead right away. The Sigma is going to target R. I was confused. Yeah, the, I didn't see the outlines there. That was strange. Oh, they teleported in. No. Nah. I believe we're at the Fera Mercy combo. They're going and to try to get rid of the I mean, little itty bitty annoying little sentry turns. Yeah, as, as we do have on the whiteboard up there, Farrah. They are going to sit up top on our spawn. Mm hmm. I mean, one thing I will say, so we do see on the board over there, Farrah plus Mercy does equal cringe. Here comes the, the mini defense matrix, for lack of better words of it. Yeah. Somber almost getting a kill. Mm hmm. Oh. Feels like every time we almost get a kill, they just get killed right yep. back. Or just teleport away. Oh, 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 yeah. A symmetric teleport. A symmetric teleport. <laughs> Here comes the hack onto the Ana. Oh, barely. So Ana's not dead. Not our Ana. Not, not their Ana. Our Ana died, though. There's Taking the out the Symmetra. The symmetra. <laughs> and then here goes Farah onto the Ana. Dive, dive, dive. Reaper's up next to the Mercy now. But, That's going to be a kill. Reaper's going to fade out. That's going to be a kill. Pick out the kill on the Reaper Sigma's as well. still on point. Using, using the sub. Mm -hmm. Gets hacked and gets deleted. Now let's see if we can actually push out uh, yeah. our spawn. <laughs> <laughs> Rocket jumping. Feels like I'm watching TF2 gameplay. I want TF2 back. The hurt happening to the far right now. Mm -hmm. She's just healing it all back. Gaining all the health back with the pocket, Mercy. Mercy is in her ult currently. Ooh. Almost getting good, the that Reaper. Was a, that was a good... A good dodge. idea. That was a good dodge from our far to not get hit by that, mm -hmm. that Sigma ult. That Reaper almost getting knocked off. Almost. If only he wouldn't have got protected by that wall. It just... That wall is definitely not helping anything when it comes to the Farah. Yeah. I think the Farah was a good counter here that uh, mm -hmm. ha we hadn't seen. Definitely. You're getting the Ana the just... Ball. Barely getting away from the Reaper. Taking a teleporter, teleporter as well. The Symmetra is definitely a pick here. Definitely. It's, 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 it's a pick you don't see often. Lucio's down. Now it's just All the Sigma and the Symmetra. They're both, both of them going down. Along with, six, I believe that was the Ana right there. Hiding. There's the Reaper. The Reaper tries to enter in. So low. He's going he's gonna to fade in. He's going to be alone. I don't think the Reaper's going to be able to make it out of that one alive. No, nope, the Reaper dies there. He has now basically staggered himself inadvertently. We do have Primal, primal on, up. Monk, on the monkey. Mm-hmm. Along with USM being able to cap the first point. That's a sleep on the monkey right away. Mm -hmm. There's a good kill into the back line for the Lucio. Soldier. Taking up the soldier there. on a kill. That was revenge. That, that had that, something personal attached I mean, to it. Yeah, <laughs> with the Helix rockets, there's always finding Ethan. Yeah. A, a much bigger rocket found that soldier. How does it feel, soldier? <laughs> We do we have, have I, mean, I, feel, I feel like this barrage is always up with how much damage Ethan is putting out. Oh, oh no. that the, helix truck. Not the, not the helix again. Never mind. What have we said? What have, what have we done? What have you, what did you do, John? I just said he was going for revenge. I didn't say anything. I'm else. blaming this on you because I can't take responsibility for my actions. <laughs> oh, the reaper waiting for this. 
he, Sombra giving up. Sombra didn't. Just like, there's no way I'm winning that. He's going to respawn and get ready to go again. Zero up in the air with a damage boost. Just put in out being rocket. A nuisance. He's very close to where their ground level is. Yeah. This is very bad for Fara. Ooh, the death sleep, blossom. The but they do onto pick up the mercy and for the death blossom to get a kill. But then they do pick up the uh, the reaper. They do take out the reaper before he gets any more. Uh, I was gonna say free kills, but yeah, that's basically what it is is just free kills. Oh, it's so what? I keep working into the. I I don't like reapers. I'll get one button play of the game. I mean, basically, so is Genji's. Well, I mean, Genji, at least, you have to protect. click, you have to, you know, Dash. you don't heal all of the damage you're taking back on your own. I meant, Sigma's could be a one-button play of the game. Yeah, but you have to aim it. I mean, you have to aim, you have to aim yourself as Reaper. Yeah, you but have then to be you in also, the right position. But you also have a teleport and an invulnerability speed up. That's fair. I mean, everything you're saying is fair. I'm just trying to mm -hmm. be a contrarian now. The soldier just creeping. <laughs> But then there's also a soldier with like actual aimbot and all. It's all it is, just hold down, shoot, and then shooty. That was a great EMP Ooh, from USM. Definitely. Gonna get. Oh, picking up the. <laughs> Starkey. Pick, yeah, picking up the soldier. Starkey with that EMP is yeah. gonna get an assist with every single one of those. He might get play of the game instead of Ethan. Mm hmm. That Sigma is. Just tanking hurt. everything. He is hurt, he's hiding, he's running away. He didn't get booped, apparently, but he's dead. Mm hmm. And they're looking to be extra aggressive today. USM's like, you know, if y'all can do it, we can do it too. Yeah. Here goes the, the Cassidy. Cass. Ooh. Oh, Starkey is getting melted by the Cassidy as soon as. I mean, yeah. Oh, zero, almost getting a kill on that. We have Sigma Soldier all There's on all all about the to come up. Sleep. And Lucio ult. The sleep was so vital there. Oh my god, the Appreciate Sigma just bouncing oh, in and out of the barrier. It teleports out of the rock. The Sigma ult, uh, but I don't think it would be a good We're time to use it. We're going to have our own Sigma ult here. I don't think it would be a good time to use it right now. No, because, it's not, but I'm just mm -hmm. saying we have it. The Sigma, if almost can, making it out. If we can survive that. Ethan's switching off to the... They're, they're counter-picking at this point. Yeah. Name of the game. Oh, Ooh, barely left. making it out. Here comes the Sombra coming into the back lines. Ooh, big soldier. Sol oh. Soldier cannot sprint anymore. We hacked his legs. His yep. legs no longer work. I, I always thought that was pretty funny. But now there's Sojourn with actual robotic legs. Here goes Cassidy. Ooh, Cassidy Cassidy's going down. down. Oh, here goes, here goes Sig. Sig is gonna suck up all incoming projectiles. Basically a mini defense matrix. Yep. Here comes Ana. Ana's purple. Ooh, but the, but the oh, but Lucio. From Lucio. Ana is still one though. She's still hurt. Never mind. She's not, but she, she dies. Is. She's not, she's not feeling pain anymore. I don't know what pain is. I'm dead. Yep. We do have Sojourn almost on one. Uh, I, I will say, I feel like whoever whoever came with the concept of this game, and also TF2, was taking crack just because how fast-paced this game has to be. That well, was a good mm -hmm. That was a great pack. They were just like chugging energy drinks down. Either on crack or energy drinks. One of the two, maybe both. If it's both, they probably aren't here anymore. <laughs> Overtime. And Overtime. Not get it, and that is. That was a close last match. That was all three games. Yeah. GG's coming from everybody in the chat. Lord. Who is gonna get? We do see Zed on the enemy signal getting play. This this man. This man was the epitome of an attack. Uh, Sigma. Yep. Damage he, he went demon mode. He was he was in the state of mind of being evil. Was, yeah. That that was absolutely crazy. Mm -hmm. Sad loss for USM. Good game. Definitely some close game. 
close games. ETSU, appreciate the competition. Hope everyone gets home safe if y'all are uh, in a lab of any sort. Uh, good games. Mm -hmm. Congratulations on your victory. Have a good night. Have a good night. Uh, Coca-Cola. <laughs> I drank the water. Drink the water. Well, technically, rain is also a Coca-Cola product. It's in a Coca-Cola vending machine. They just own everything, I guess. Huh? They own everything. Yeah, they just own everything. Uh, I, we're not going to have a post-game show for this. Uh, we're going to get back with Rainbow Six at what time? 7.30. 7.30. So Rainbow Six at 7.30, it's going to be me and Aaron over here on the casting booth just running the gauntlet tonight. Uh, we will catch all of you guys later, and this is a farewell from USM. Have a good night.